Good afternoon, I'm Jordan Nelson, and this is your BCIT News Minute for November 12th. A new study has found children's mental health is likely to be significantly affected by the COVID-19 pandemic. The research found anxiety, depression, behavioral issues, and post-traumatic stress can become far more common in children. The study was commissioned by the BC Representative for Children and Youth. They found social inequalities in society heighten mental health effects of the pandemic. The Fraser Health Authority has declared COVID-19 outbreaks at three long-term care facilities in the region. One resident in Langley, another from White Rock, and a staff member from Surrey have all tested positive for the virus. The Health Authority said in a press release that enhanced control measures have been put in place at each site. Minister of Environment and Climate Change Jonathan Wilkinson announced $3.9 million in support of 53 new projects to improve freshwater ecosystems. Wilkinson says it will be a cost-shared program providing support to nonprofit organizations. One project is here in BC involving the BC Conservation Foundation. The project plans to restore coastline habitat and prevent pollution of the Sunshine Coast. That was your BCIT News Minute for Thursday, November 12th. I'm Jordan Nelson and thank you for watching.